Want to test Australia's best blood sausage? Thought you could just run away from the admin. <laughs> You've really got my attention now. Jesse. Jesse. Hello, Jesse. Nowhere to run. Stand still! Hmm. Well dodged. You are resilient. Though sadly, still mortal! Oh dear. Is there a leak in here? <laughs> Why, hello. Die now. Are you? Really? What a dangerous world, Jesse. You are so tiny, and there is so much distance to cover. Also, you know, me. <laughs> Jesse! I placed every block you've ever stood on. And I promise, I will place the blocks that cover your grave. <laughs> Jesse. <laughs> I've been watching you for quite some time. 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 All those accomplishments, all those people you've saved, the world loves you. All those accomplishments, all those people you saved, oh, the world loves you. All those accomplishments, all those people you saved, the world loves you. All those accomplishments, all those people you saved, the world loves you. But you mustn't forget, 
that this isn't your world, Jesse. But you mustn't forget that this isn't your world, Jesse. But you mustn't forget that this isn't your world, Jesse. But you mustn't forget that this isn't your world, Jesse. It's mine. No. It's mine. No. It's mine. Oh no. It's mine. I think we're in for a good time. I think we're in for a rather good time. I think we're in for a rather good time. I think we're in for a rather good time. Don't you? Jesse. Hmm? <laughs> 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 your courage is so much larger than your puny size. I could peek my teeth with that blade. What a liar. I'll make you eat your words. You fail, Jesse. Ta-ta, Jesse. Ha, ah, clever. Using my own structure block against me. Look out below. Ha <laughs> ha. Finders keepers. This tiny thing won't save you, Jesse. Not from me. Oh. Hide and seek is beneath you, Jesse. The champion should be better than this. Found you. If you're going to be a coward, Jesse, just give yourself up. There you are. <clears throat> so annoying. Got you. There we are. <laughs> Looking a little helpless, champion. Goodbye. <sighs> Jesse. <sighs> You can't outrun me forever. Come now, Jesse. All this stalling is just making me angrier. You're protecting Jesse. Oh, please. All these interruptions are becoming annoying. That ends now. And game over. I knew you'd come eventually. Ha! <sighs> Where are you? Oh, I'm sorry. Sure would be a pity if... Oops. Finally. Down the hatch. <laughs> Confidence. The mark of a true hero. <sighs> a true hero. Clever distraction, Jesse. I'm using champion there sarcastically. Do you really think you can defeat me, Jesse? 
Don't let them down. <laughs> ah, so much for them. <laughs> Just you and me now, champion. I wish to speak with Jesse, the gauntlet bearer. Greetings, tiny people. I am the admin. It's hard to hear your tiny voice from down there. I know, that's why I was like, looking right at you. Ahem. <clears throat> Sorry, that was probably really loud to your pathetic, tiny ears. I would like to proceed, Gauntlet Bearer. Do not test my patience. Ah, there you are, Jesse. But now, your true test begins. It is time you fight me. Oh, it's so cute when you tiny adventurers lie. Oh, 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 oh. this is going to be perfect. You've got the knack. Oh, no, no, no. No tricks. I'm serious. Game. Ha. Huh. Why, the greatest game of all. Ah, I see. You're confused. Let me explain. Seriously, you're a natural. I loved what you did with the Witherstorm. Awesome stuff. To tempt you down to the Sea Temple. Fight me, champion. Unless you'd like to see that happen to your entire town. Flee, tiny beacon towners. Flee for your lives. Ha ha! Fighting in broad daylight is boring. Let's add some... drama. Who knows what I'll do next? <laughs> That's why I left you the gauntlet. Come, speak with me face to face. Sorry, did you say something? It's kind of hard to hear you down there. Aha! Hello, everyone! <laughs> please, please gather round. Y y don't be shy. Well, of course you are, because you're a hero. <laughs> it's awesome. No, nothing. You're the hero stepping up to the precipice of your next great challenge, and you've got nothing to say. Cook this place up just for you. I mean, it's pretty... Well, I was going to say pretty cool, but with a whole ice motif, that just seems like I was going for a lame pun, so... Anyway, spectacular, though, isn't it? Your choice of company... Yeah, I don't know. I mean, this place is really for the best of the best. Not... Uh, how do I say this? Losers? No, never. It's actually perfect, champion. I can see you all have dreams of greatness. It's very cute. So, we'll see how your little companions do, hey? Mm-hmm. Cool. If you say so. Um, my near infinite power? I thought that was obvious. It's simple. You all want to get to that clock, but only the best of the best get to partner up with me in the future. Oh, look how many of you there are. Lovely. This construct before you, it's meant to see who's worthy of that greatness. Separate the strong from the weak. Oh, come now, don't be that way. This, this is all for you. But that could be you. And that's what I like to hear. I knew you'd understand. Can't say I care for your attitude. But that's fine. You'll figure it out soon enough. Oh, ho, ho, I am just ecstatic that you see things my way. Thrilled! <laughs> so, how about we get this show on the road? New creatures of my own design, as well as mining fatigue at every turn. Wouldn't want you cheating, of course. I don't like rule breakers. The one and only. I had so much fun during our last little battle. Super epic. Just couldn't stay away. Oh, that giant prismarine colossus. <laughs> Just a construct. Rolled it up for the occasion. Pretty fun, right? Uh, yeah. I mean, with the smashing and the punching and the crazy do-or-die plans to protect the little people. Oh, unbelievable. 
Ah, uh, see? I knew you'd know what I was talking about. I just thought it'd be a little easier to talk like this. Oh, come on. Come on, don't do me like that. You have to admit, you've been having a little fun along the way. All those guardian fish? The temple? Hey? Ah, uh, now, now I can tell you Actually, I can't tell how you're feeling. Anger? Joy? Pretty ennui? Help me to help you. Well, it's kind of cuddly, right? See, you four went into my temple, back out alive. Heroes, you're perfect for my creations. Perfect. Got a new challenge for you. Trust me, you're gonna love it. You hear that? That's a diamond-class wave of doom and destruction headed right for town. <laughs> Pretty good, right? Been working on that one. Why? <laughs> Why? Well, because it's fun, obviously. I mean, this is going to be epic. Ooh, a hero with attitude. I love it. I really do. I get it. I get it. You're angry. Oh, well, that'll pass. Ahem. <clears throat> Your town will be trapped in eternal snowy night. Forever plagued by deadly waves of mobs until you recapture that clock. I'm glad you asked. It's at the tippy top of my awesome, fantastic, super deadly, icy palace of despair. Oh, it is. I mean, I don't want to brag, but it is, like, <laughs> really hard. You'll see. Oh, that one gave me the shivers. You are legit, Jesse. Very excited. Yeah, well, technically, you're the one putting them in danger if you don't go after the clock. So, uh, is it because I look like this? Yeah, I can see why you'd think that. But no, 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 I'm just fine. I promise you. Speechless, right? Yeah, understandable. Ah, strays. Pesky little consequence of eternal night. And <laughs> Beacon Town's new neighbours until you take care of that clock. Remember, find the clock, save the town. Bye-bye now. <laughs> Innocent or incentive? I don't know. Seems like they've got you pretty motivated. You think you've got it all figured out, don't you? It's simple. Just follow the path. You can't miss it. Oh, it is great to see you in here. You're my favourite group. True story. And I just know you're going to demolish this room. It's simple. <laughs> All you need to do is find your way out. I guess you could put it that way. You won't get any hints from me, though. <laughs> All right, it's time to get this proverbial party started. I am very excited to see how you do. Don't worry, they're right there. Now, will you be able to get them back out, is the question. <laughs> oh, you, you are a riot. <laughs> no, really. <laughs> oh, uh, farewell now, and uh, uh, good luck. <laughs> oh, me. Uh, uh, okay, no, 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 no. This is all wrong, people, wrong. You're not supposed to help each other. The losers are supposed to lose. Like this guy. There is no way he would have made it out if you weren't giving him the intellectual assist. Jettison that baggage. There was no way Radar would have fought his way out of that room without you. You should have just cut him loose. Y you don't get it. I'm trying to separate the diamonds from the gravel here. Rubbish gets dumped. Let's see how our bucko does on his own, eh? What do you think the chances are? Without Jesse. <sighs> Fine, you convince me. It's not often I give second chances. A one condition, though. Like spectacles over here. Ah. Do I see you wannabes getting frisky with me? Aw. Oh. I'm seeing someone like you held back by that? Oh, painful. <sighs> I gotta say, if you're having a hard time with the minecarts, you might not like what comes next. Hello there, it's me again, your friendly neighbourhood admin. <laughs> Pretty proud of this challenge, not gonna lie. I was feeling very inspired by the concept of karma. 
I'm sure you understand, right? Real heroes live for surprises. Unexpected dangers. I just told you I'm not going to spoil the surprise. Just play along here. See, now that's the kind of behaviour I like to see in a champion. <laughs> Confident, cool under pressure. Oh, you'll go far. It's all games, champion. Winning, losing, that's what life's all about. Now, once you figure that out, you'll be much happier. Stoic hero in the face of danger, eh? Excellent. Let's just say I hope you're feeling good about your archery skills, hmm? Between you and me, though, champion, I'm less worried about your archery than I am about your choice of companions. Let's see if I can't shuffle the board a bit, hmm? Give you another pair of hands to help out? He's no Jesse, but he's better than that other guy, right? Oh, 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 dear. Oh, wait. No, I'm totally messing with you. Time for level two. Not bad. Not bad. You're a fine shot. Almost feels like I made this challenge too easy for you. <laughs> all you need to do is activate the shooting gallery, hit all the targets, and the door will open. <laughs> easy, right? But I'd tell you why, but, well, that'd spoil the surprise. Oh, you are a smart cookie, Jesse. Of course I am. I am disappointed, Jesse. You obviously just don't have what it takes to really be my friend. Well, no, not the whole time, you nitwit. The real Voss never would have survived down there that long. And you? <laughs> well, you are incredibly bold. Oh, come on, it was kind of exciting, right? Sort of a surprise reveal? No. Nope. No, I'm afraid it's too late for that. Now, what to do with you? My partner. Such a pity. Such a waste. But you lost. Oh, really? But, uh, hold on a moment. Really? You think that would work on me? You've seen me, right? You really do have a thing or two you could learn from Stella here. Well, skills lacking, but she's got a terrific attitude. You don't say? Huh. But, uh, Stella, was it? See, she may not have the skills, but that is a terrific attitude. Your attitude, on the other hand? Oh, well. There's nothing that hurts more than broken hopes. I made this for you. Just for you. And how do you repay me? You cheated! I try and gather the world's greatest warriors, but no one appreciates my genius. How could you do this to me? That, let me tell you, that really burns. Oh, nah, nope. You are more interested in saving those loser friends of yours. That practically negates all of the other stuff. Oh, that's adorable. They're mad they got manipulated. I should be mad that I had to waste all that time looking like that crusty old adventurer. See, now you're just being rude and lashing out, and I don't care for it. I have to tell you, Jesse, the Silent Claire thing is really not cute right now. I gave you so many chances, but <laughs> it hasn't all been to waste. No, no, you might not be worthy. Poof. Technically, Jack here was the winner. Oh, don't get me wrong. There are quite a few flaws we'll have to work through, but we'll get there. In time. Technically, Petra here was the winner. Oh, don't even worry about it. It's not for a loser like you to worry about where the cool people go. Oh. Cute. Ugh. You really are just hopeless. What? What? <laughs> Shh. Like I said. Not for you guys to worry about. I'm done letting you make me feel bad. I prefer to feel good. And I'm going to feel real good when I send you two to a place where you'll never see the light of day. Ever again. I'm actually a little more flat management. <laughs> Shh. Like I said, not for you guys to worry about. No, not the whole time, you nitwit. The real Voss would never have survived in my sea temple that long. Now, stage one. B. 
begin. Ooh, wow, what a showdown, folks. We're having the time of our lives, aren't we? Stage one of 600. <laughs> Complete. Stage two. And begin. Now, prepare yourselves for... <clears throat> Stage 600! <laughs> I see your smiles. Now, now, I'm not a monster. There is a crafting table nearby. <laughs> Welcome, challengers Zara, Fred and... Me, Romeo! Are you ready for the most thrilling, death-defying, heart-pounding challenge you've ever experienced? <laughs> Congratulations, challengers! Oh, you've done it! Oh, yes! The power of our friendship prevails! I hope you're learning how to be a cooperative champion. You are all here to be reminded of your potential. And I hope you'll see it in yourself, as I do. Because if you don't, well, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it, eh? In the meantime, demonstrate your cooperative potential, and you just may become the ultimate champion! Hello, guests and associates. Admin here with a reminder. Helping others will only drag you down. Losers are supposed to lose. Say it with me now. Losers are supposed to lose. Right, let that be your mantra. Good day. Hello, guests and associates. Admin here, reminding you that despite being so close to finding a suitable champion, the spot remains open to all. Especially any wannabe adventurers whose names might rhyme with Nessie. Just find that out there. Good day. OK, whatever, you know who this is. I can't believe that Jesse decided to ruin a good thing, that a great thing, by rescuing Jesse's group of friends from the Ender Creepers. I mean, seriously. Do you have any idea how much I... Ah, oh, forget it. And I hope you'll see it in yourself, as I do. Because if you don't, well... We'll cross that bridge when we come to it, eh? I hope you're learning how to be a cooperative champion. You are all here to be reminded of your potential. In the meantime, demonstrate your cooperative potential, and you just may become the ultimate champion. I'm very disappointed in you, Warden. No, no, not that. Your star guard, Jesse is nothing but a saboteur. Ugh, no, not that. I'm disappointed that you couldn't keep Jesse in line for one measly day. I don't know if you're dense or what, but working somewhere usually means you don't do things to actively destroy where you work. Not good for business. Pretty sure your fellow inmates were just trying to peacefully live out the rest of their captivities. They've got it hard enough in here without nuisances like you gumming up the works. Ugh, it's terribly rude, is what it is. Oh, you really think so, eh? <laughs> boy, oh boy, I can't wait to see that. Misunderstandings? Oh, we are way past misunderstandings. Way past. Oh, you think you're cute, don't you? The warden told me you were zooming up the associate ladder. Now you're trying to disrupt the therapeutic benefits of my zombie mine? What gives? It's not enough that you disregarded all the rules in my icy palace of doom, tried to upset the delicate order of the Sunshine Institute. Now you're trying to disrupt the therapeutic benefits of my zombie mine? Oh, for the love of... Enough! I'm through letting you disappoint me. And that goes for you, and you, and you, and especially... You. And as for you, I've been looking for an opportunity for you to prove your loyalty. To prove your worth as my champion. Psst. You're gonna need that. Seems only fair. So, unless you want to be added to my naughty list, I suggest you pull out your sword and attack Jesse. Oh, all I ask you to do is fight your friend to the death and you can't even do that. 
I don't even want you to be my friend anymore, and I don't want you to be my friend either. Guess I'll just be my own friend now. Can't dwell on the setbacks. Gotta keep looking forward. <sighs> I'm gonna have loads of friends soon. After all. To you, maybe. But I don't care what you think. Oh, I think I know what I'm doing. Oh, spare me the pity party. I don't need it. Oh, of course. Of course it's Jessie. Why am I not surprised? And as for you, Jessie, well, don't think I don't believe in fair play. <laughs> now we'll have some real fun. I had such high hopes for you, Jessie. The highest of hopes. You could have been my champion. And you gave it all away. And then, then, you had the nerve to destroy Wonderland. The disappointments pile on. Oh, this is more like it. This is what a true friend is. Are you afraid, Jessie? I'd get over it quick if you are. <laughs> you're, you're joking, right? That's your big idea. Swords can't hurt me. In fact, as far as I'm concerned, this whole place can burn to the ground. The Institute remains inescapable. So what do I care? I'm leaving. And I'm never thinking about any of you ever again. Now, stage one. Begin. Ooh, wow, what a showdown, folks. We're having the time of our lives, aren't we? Stage one of 600. <laughs> Complete! Stage two. And begin. Now, prepare yourselves for... <coughs> Stage 600! <laughs> I see your smiles. Now, now, I'm not a monster. There is a crafting table nearby. <laughs> Welcome, challengers Zara, Fred, and me, Romeo. Are you ready for the most thrilling, death-defying, heart-pounding challenge you've ever experienced? <laughs> Congratulations, challengers. Oh, you've done it. Oh, yes. The power of our friendship prevails. <sighs> <sighs> I know I was all fiery and mad when you first showed up, but it's just as well. Blimey! I had no idea being you was going to be this difficult. Oh, yeah! I'm, I'm, I'm bloody exhausted. The, the constant whining, everyone asking for things all the time. I need iron blocks. I'm out of bricks. I don't want to be surrounded by lava. Ugh. It's insufferable. Oh, yes. And it's like, oh, hello, uh, can I get a little me time? <laughs> what? I, I, I can handle it. I'm just bored. Yeah, that's all. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I suppose you could. Yeah. Anyway, uh, what am I telling you all that for, eh? I'm probably preaching to the choir. Oh, you know what? It's just as well you're back. Because being Jesse is the worst. Oh, yes. Yes, I said it. I hate being you. Your, your people, your friends, they're so needy, so clingy. I have to listen to their stupid voices day after day after day, just asking for things. I, mean, I, I thought being Jesse meant that people would do what I wanted to do. <sighs> yes, well, it's terribly disappointing is what it is. No one ever asks what I want. Ah, oh, it's all, can I have iron and can I have gold? And what are they using all that stuff for anyway? Oh, so annoying. It's just, <sighs> but it was fun at first. I'd show them some super amazing display of my awesome powers. They'd laugh. I'd laugh. But soon they were just asking me to do that all the time. To you, you know? <laughs> the, the, the genuine article. 
<laughs> yeah, maybe that is the best way to proceed. <laughs> I'm so glad you agree. Oh, thanks, Jesse. I appreciate that. Nope. No tricks, no angles, no games. Just good old Romeo telling it like it is. <sighs> well, this has all been terribly enlightening, and I, I think we've all learned some great lessons here that I will totally remember for next time. Yeah, the next world I build after I bedrock over yours. Oh, I'm going to get it totally right with that one. A whole new set of people. A whole new world. Oh, I'll be a great leader, a great friend next time around. I should thank you for all these, these wonderful little lessons you've helped me to learn. Yeah? You, you really think so? Hmm. Nah. Bedrocking time. Could. Would love to. But won't. Shan't. This way is easier for me. Oh, maybe. Maybe I'll have more fjords in the next one. <laughs> oh, I love a good fjord. I wonder if there's any way to make the next set of people any friendlier. Huh. Huh. Really thought you would have had something to say there. Disappointing. Oh, well. <sighs> Toodles. <laughs> you, know, you know what's funny? You've made me see something. I mean, it's starting to feel like maybe I should just leave being Jesse. Oh. Well, you don't really have much of a choice, do you? <laughs> Sorry. But it's time to start fresh. Make a new world. No. Wait, please, 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 stop. Don't take all my powers away. Don't you judge me. You don't get to judge me. Give me back that gauntlet. That's the cause of all this. And if you won't give it back, well, I'll, I'll just, just tear, tear it off, off you. you. Um, and all! There! You never should have made me feel small! Gauntlet delivered! Gold protocol! <laughs> well, ahoy there, Jesse! Care for a dance with the Velvet Tornado? Oh, you wouldn't attack old Jack, right? Not after everything we've been through together. Maybe not. But it's certainly a nice form to use. When I destroy you! <laughs> well, hi, Jesse. Aren't you happy to see me? Our friendship's gotten a little rocky on this adventure, hasn't it? Little worn thin? I wonder who did that? No? That's a shame. Here I thought it would be a nice way of working through some things. Oh no. No, 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 not here. Not like this. Not as him. Without them, I don't know what I'd do. You, you can't take that from me. Get, get off me. Get, get off me. Password protocol initiated. Support protocol initiated. Admin protocol initiated. Welcome to Terminal Space. You've selected password protocol. You've selected support protocol. You've selected admin protocol. Please enter your password to begin a new program. Waiting for material request. Acquiring potatoes. Items dispensed. Thank you. The automated personal assistant system was developed to aid the mighty admin in menial tasks and help his friends navigate the terminal space. Ugh. What do you think you're doing? I told you. Your world's done. No take backs. Parrot party protocol initiated. What? Gauntlet. Delivered. Gold protocol. This is your big plan. Run directly at me. No. I... What? Come on! I don't know what you're playing at, but it ends now! Oh, Jesse. To think what could have been, eh? I said it ends now! Oh, you, you think you're very clever, don't you? Well, how about we finish this with a little change of scenery? What have you done? What's happening? There is a key difference between a good friend and a bad one. 
Good friends do what you ask. They enjoy what you make for them. They never betray you. Jesse is a perfect example of what we call a bad friend. Other bad friends include, in no particular order, Fred and Zara. Ultimately, all losers who refuse to appreciate the gifts they'd been given. Now me, I won't stand for ingratitude. So I took my gifts away. Oh, but then, then, just when I thought I'd found a promising new friend... Grrr, such a disappointment. That is when I had a brilliant idea. The perfect way to weed out the bad friends from the good. To be appreciated. I became Jesse. I was right, of course. The plan worked immediately. Jesse's good friends flocked to me. The better Jesse. <sighs> and now poor Jesse is dead, having never learned his lesson. <laughs> and now Jesse is trapped underground forever. One more ungrateful loser buried away. <sighs> and now poor Jessie is dead, having never learned her lesson. The saddest part of all, really, is that Jessie will never get to see how much better I've made Beacon Town. <laughs> oh, yes! <laughs> For everything you've done! <sighs> I can still do this. I'm still... Going to kill you, Jesse. I can't even teleport anymore. Get away from me. I'd rather die than let you beat me. You. You hurt me. <laughs> I can I can still oh I'm I've got to I'm going to the to destroy you oh, no, 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 no. Don't you give me that pity that mercy Oh Spare me, please! I am gonna destroy you! All of you! I will use everything! Everything I have! If it means ending you! Give it us! No! It's mine! It's mine! Get your weirdly muscular arms off me! No! I'll kill you! You! You're pathetic! You're all pathetic! Once I get my hands back on that gauntlet! I certainly hope you're enjoying this trip down memory lane as much as I am. Ah! Oh, I am very much starting to hate that stupid gauntlet! Take that! And that! Oh, what's the matter? Not a fan of the snow! <laughs> oh, I am going to... Oh, you don't... Don't touch me! Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 not here! Not like this! Not as... Him. Without them, I don't know what I'd do! You... you can't take that from me! Boy, please, please, stop! Don't take all my powers away! Don't you judge me! You don't get to judge me! Give me back that gauntlet! That's the cause of all this! And if you won't give it back... Well... I'm just tearing it off you! Um, at all! Ah! <sighs> there! You, you never should have made me feel small. I... I... Thank you. Sincerely. I hardly believe that I deserve to be here at all anymore. 
I do know what I need to do to make up for my crimes, though. I'm going to return to the underneath. Try to help all the people I left behind. Fix all the lives I... Ruined. I can't even begin to make up for... What I did to Sarah. I can't believe I did that. I, I, I didn't mean... I mean, it, it shouldn't have... Yeah, I, I know. But I still want to try. I know. It's true. I know she did. And I don't want that to be in vain. I... Yes, I, I know. I know it's not enough. But I have to try. And... And no more admin powers. Everything I do now will just be the normal way. Hope I can still remember how the normal way even works. And I'm going to try and find Zara. See if I can't make things right between us. I mean, it doesn't make up for what I... What I did to Fred. But if I can heal things with Zara... Well, it's something, at least. Well, then that's a risk I have to take. She's sort of the only friend I have left. <laughs> Seems fitting that my only friend wants to kill me. Yeah, I hope so. She's sort of the only friend I have left now. It's like, it's like it wasn't even me. I, I can't explain it, and I know no excuses will make up for it. Yeah. Yeah, and it'll all be over soon. Leave me. Save yourselves while you can. Redeemed. You... You really believe that, don't you? Oh, she's right. Just... Just leave me. My power... It was just frosting on a, on a cake. An empty, worthless cake. I deserve to stay here and pay for the mess I made. My powers are the cause of all this in the first place. No, this is where I belong. This is where I'll pay for what I've done. Go on, leave me. I deserve to stay in this oblivion. I... I don't have my powers. I, I can't control it. Oi! Stoneface! Over here! I'm the one you want! Come and get it! Penance, Jesse. I did say I would pay for my mistakes, eh? Saving your lives. I told you! I told you I'd pay for what I did! Yeah, come on! That's a good Colossus. Why'd you have to go and make everything so difficult? Everyone likes you. And you're nothing. What? No, no, I'm not. I just... I just wanted people to... People to... I can't believe that... That this is what it took for me to realise. Oh, I've been just so stupid, so blind. Well then, well, what, what are you going to do with me? Wait, this place is held together by my powers. No more powers. No more terminal zone. <sighs> We're doomed. Would you settle for me, sausage? <laughs>